what is up guys i'm brg tech here and this is the oneplus 6 the most anticipated smartphone of 2018 as you know it's the most trending phone right now let's see how oneplus did its best to keep the oneplus 6 the flagship killer when you pick up the oneplus 6 for the first time the first thing you notice is the display with a notch with rounded corners it's an all screen amoled display with 19 is to 9 ratio every smartphone in 2018 are most probably having this notch and people started accepting it like a new trend. The rear cameras are positioned vertically with a less camera bump and a dual tone flashlight. Followed by the fingerprint sensor which is now a rectangular shape and placed perfectly reachable. And next to it is the small shining OnePlus logo. The alert slider is moved to the right side of the phone which I really like. The power button is also at the right side of the phone and the volume broker stays at the left side. The speaker grills, 3.5mm headphone jack and an USB Type-C charging port are at the bottom side. The antenna bands are slightly subtle that makes the design more gorgeous. The design of the phone is simply perfect. The OnePlus 6 comes in three variants and one limited edition. Uh, the mirror black which comes with the bottom line specs with 6 gigs of RAM and 64 gigs of internal storage and 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of internal storage. The mirror black is too much glossy that it could be harmful to minor scratches if you don't use a phone case. To be honest the mirror black is too much fingerprint magnet. I would suggest you to get some best skins from dbrand skins if you need them. I will leave the link below in the description if you need to buy that one. The next one is the midnight black which is otherwise the matte black version. Uh, the body is clearly matte black with soft rough surface which is nice to touch and easy to use without a case or a phone skin. The midnight black comes with only one configuration which is 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of internal storage and this is the silk white version of OnePlus 6. The back side of the phone is white with a soft gold like color for both camera borders, fingerprint sensor and the OnePlus logo. The side of the silk white version also has the same soft gold color which is really nice. The silk white version comes with only 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of internal storage. The silk white version will be available in the first week of June. Now let's look at the common spec sheet of OnePlus 6. Snapdragon 845 processor, Adreno 630 GPU, 6 and 8 gigs of RAM variants, 64 and 128 gigs of internal storage variants, a full screen optic AMOLED display of 6.28 inches with 19 is to 9 ratio, dual SIM slot, Bluetooth 5.0, NFC, non removable battery with fast charging. The main camera is Sony IMX 519 with 16 megapixel with object image stabilization with an aperture of f1.7 and the secondary camera is Sony IMX 376K with 20 megapixel with the same aperture of f1.7. This is the first time I'm using a phone with dual cameras with same aperture. I'm pretty sure that OnePlus will bring quality software update to bring the photos to look much better. You can record 4K resolution videos at 30 and 60 frames per second, 1080p resolution videos at 30 and 60 frames per second, 720p video at 30 frames per second and a super slow motion mode with 1080p at 240 frames per second and 720p video at 480 frames per second. The face camera is Sony IMX371 with 16 megapixel with electronic image stabilization which has a fixed focus with an aperture of f2.0. It was really cool that the face camera itself had a portrait mode which was really impressive with its awesome software recognition for the image. It was too fast to detect and and the photo background blur looked great. And there is this limited edition of OnePlus 6, the Avengers edition with a black carbon fiber texture with a glossy surface with a gold OnePlus logo and a gold Avengers logo. And if you notice the alert slider itself is also a gold color. This limited edition comes with a massive storage capacity of 256 gigs of internal storage and 8 gigs of RAM. This limited edition costs 44,999. OnePlus 6 could survive in water but it's not a water resistant or certified water resistant like IP67 or IP68. It's not certified yet. It could only take a small spill of water or sometimes the phone could survive if you drop in water and quickly get it out. It's not yet fully water resistant like other flagship phones out there. The mirror black version is having a glass back but yet it doesn't have a wireless charging but I'm truly satisfied with the fast charging. OnePlus has made some sacrifices to reach this far for this price. So this is all you have to know about OnePlus 6 and you have to make the right choice to buy this phone by choosing the right variant that suits you for your daily use. I really do like the midnight black and the mirrored black variants but, but it's just me. Let me know which variant you like much in the comments. Please subscribe to my channel to know more updates. Please leave a like and don't forget to check out the link in the description. It will help you to buy the best skins for your new OnePlus 6. And yeah, thank you so much for watching.
Happy purchasing and good luck. Oh, 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 oh,